Hello everyone, welcome back. We have another Adobe Premiere Pro tutorial. This one's a quick and easy one. I'm going to show you how to do some basic color correction. Color correction is is big in the film industry. Uh, you'll see a, people will take a shot of a, a scene and then they'll be like, you know what, we want it to be a little bit darker, or we want some atmosphere, or we want some, you know, we want some sort of different lighting. Color correction is a big deal, but it's especially important in the DSLR slash hand cam uh, short film industry that's popping up, people making YouTube videos and things like that. And the reason why is because when you do your own videos, if you have like a camera and you're out doing your own thing, well obviously you don't have the money or the resources to bring along a huge um, team of, of color correctors and, and lighting people and gaffers and yada yada yada. So color correction is a big deal. And I'm going to show you how to go ahead and take some standard footage just like this warm autumn day and we're gonna make it a little bit better so let's just get right into this we're gonna go to color correction so I'm gonna look for something called color balance HLS drop that bad boy on here and it doesn't do anything out of the gate but we're gonna go ahead and change that you'll see it's popped up in the effects control panels and we're gonna try and make this image or this clip a little bit more like an autumn day so you know a little bit nice fall colors Darker, we want darker leaves and a little bit more contrast, and the white's a little bit washed out in this. So, to do that, we can go ahead and make some hue adjustments. I'll just show you what it looks like if we go like way up, way down. Uh, you can get some pretty color crazy effects in there. But for me, I want it to go a little bit darker because I want these leaves to look like autumn. So, those look like nice color leaves. That looks like a nice fall day. What do you think? Lightness. We can increase it or we can decrease it. Now, the way it is, it seems a little bit washed out to me, so I'm just going to reduce it a little bit, maybe to there. And then we can change the saturation as well. So, of course, you can season this to your taste, so you want it to be super saturated. That looks like a dream. Or you can have it undersaturated where it goes to black and white. Now... I think we should go a little bit more saturated. I want the greens to be a little bit darker, but I don't want them to be like overkill. Like if you look here, if we go too far, it's obviously overkill. So we want it to look realistic. So I think that looks pretty good. What do you think? So basic color correction using color balance HLS, you can change hue, lightness, and saturation all with a quick slider. And let's just do a quick comparison. Here's what it looks like color corrected. And you can always, you know, adjust this is a little bit too much, maybe. And then here's what it looks like when we originally shot the footage. Like that. So with, you know, 30 seconds, you can go ahead and make some great color adjustments to your footage. So anyways, guys, that's a real quick, short and dirty tutorial on how to do some basic color correction using Color Balance HLS. I'll be back shortly with some more footage. Cheers.